We're gonna make the world's highest treehouse. Uh, not this one. We've made some one-of-a-kind tree houses before, like a treehouse aquarium and an invisible tree house. This mission is going to be one of the hardest tree houses we have ever built. It'd be nice if I wasn't the only one that knew how to build things. The highest tree house in elevation a person could make is 11,000 feet, because that's the elevation that trees stop growing. So, here's the game plan. We want to make a tree house at the very top of a mountain. The only way to do this is to bring our own trees up with us because of the elevation. We're going to build a tree house at our studio, disassemble it into a U-Haul, pick up some trees, and drive to the top of a mountain where we will reassemble it, thus creating the highest tree house ever made. Burm, burm. It's now time to beta test all three of us up here to make sure this thing actually stands up. Oh, thank you. It's like crunchy sound. Whoa. Whoa. Stop, everybody down. This will hurt bad if you fall. If we walk around, no, we crawl. Why do we have to crawl every day? You don't have to walk around. Once we're up here, we just hang out. Right now. Big nerd. This is if we build it exactly how Samuel built it. Yeah, we might. It is. There's instructions. Okay. Your memory is not instructions. No, but he's making instructions. No, he's not. Yes, he is. He will do it. He will not. It's making a lot of creaks up here. It was pretty shaky, but I have high hopes. Test complete. Next time you guys see this tree house, it's gonna be on the top of a mountain. We are at the grocery store to get some snacks. Some banana ice, pumpkin muffins. Is he laughing at us? He's literally <laughs> laughing. It's so funny, pal. Because you gotta laugh every day, you know? Hey, they have prime. Should we get prime? Yes. Oh, they got the blue one. Never had blue. You tried these yet? Uh, no. Oh, they're pretty good. <laughs> Taki. Oh! Death. Wow, look at all these pumpkin spice items. Reminds me of our new song that's out now on Spotify and our music channel. Guys, we just found our favorite item here at Target. Tonight is gonna be chaos in the treehouse. A little portable heater might come in clutch. We are driving three hours to get to the top of the mountain we're going to. Mega Lunchable. Look at that bad boy. <laughs> Please don't bark in here. <laughs> no. It landed on the foot in front of you. There's too many trees around here, so we're going higher than the trees. Where no trees can grow. The sun is going down quick, and we're not even close to being at the top of the mountain. There's snow on there. We're gonna freeze to death. We're gonna die. <laughs> oh, no! Isaac just hit his arm on the window, and what did you say? Ow, I hit my funny elbow. They don't say that here in America. It's funny bone. <laughs> Hey, hey, get out of the road! <laughs> There's no guardrails. It's getting kind of sketchy. We could go tumbling down at any moment. This is just about tree line. See how the trees are starting to dwindle to where there's none left? Yeah, look at that. One more switchback, and this should be the last of the trees. No this is way. It. This is the top. Now there's a parking lot right here. There's even restrooms! Oh, 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 water! Guys, we have found our treehouse location. Right here. I'm already feeling a little dizzy. Whoa. Elevation, 12,095 feet. We gotta get building. We've got like 10 to 15 minutes of light left. We have to like unload all the supplies before we're even able to get to the treehouse. I don't know why we did this. This is our Ikea instruction booklet for the treehouse. Samuel built this all by himself. I mean, wrote it. What is that? Look, D piece, D piece, and then the F pieces go on the side, and this J piece goes here. Okay? Assemble. These are going to support the entire treehouse. So we just finished step two on Samuel's Ikea notebook. Now we're on step three. We gotta flip this thing over and put the legs on. We're making good progress. I don't think you guys understand how heavy this thing is. My arms are shot. We gotta reposition. Hold. Whoa. There we go. Okay. Is that good? Lower. The platform for our treehouse is officially built. It's five feet off the ground. We still gotta put up all the walls, the roof, the ladder. My hands are numb. It's not even remotely level. Oh. <laughs> we haven't added the support beams. <laughs> Goodbye, son. I'm starting to get a crowd. What are y'all up to? What's your best get? I don't know. I saw the tripod. Maybe you guys were like setting up something to get a shot or something. We're building the world's highest tree house. There's no, uh, there's no tree. We had to bring our own trees. That's hysterical. Good to be so good luck. Yeah, bro. Oh man, we got A with J. That looks like a gallows. Oh. Yeah. I'm not feeling confident whatsoever. What do you want the window? Glad these are lightweight. Whoa! My hands are getting cold. This is pretty cool. All right, this is the moment of truth. If the roof doesn't fit, we gotta rearrange these walls. Okay. Is that as strong? Whoa. Oh. Dude. Like a glove, dude. Dude, like a no glove. Way. We're doing it. We're gonna get a hoy. 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 
The bone chilling cold is like setting in, like my feet are freezing, my bones are freezing. Before we install the last wall piece, we're gonna use brains and fill with our supplies. Guys, it's time to install the trees. We have some exciting trees. We bought Christmas trees. These are the sharpest Christmas trees. The final tree is being installed on the tree house. It's pitch black out and we are officially done with the world's highest tree house. Check this out. This thing we built at an elevation of over 12,000 feet. We have a convenient ladder up to the front door right here. <laughs> you can't move that much or this whole thing could come tumbling down. So here we are, actually pretty spacious. It is really cool in here. We got these shelves with different snacks, drinks. We have three different beds. We each have our own negative 10 degree sleeping bag and pillow. Panini maker, TV, PS5, heater, and some nautical nonsense for tonight. Turn the heater on. Let's make some food. <laughs> okay, don't use heater yet just because we don't know how much power we have and I would rather use the heater when we're going to bed. I'm gonna plug in the panini maker. Currently we have 23 hours of power just using the lights. One, One hour. hour. One hour? Shut that off. I don't know about paninis. I turned it off and it's just boosting back up. We'll make normal sandwiches. How are we gonna power the TV? If the panini press knocked it down to an hour, what do you think the PS5 is gonna do? We got chips and three meat cheese sandwiches. So this food doesn't attract the mountain lions. Whoa. What? Oh, these chips are busting. Beverage with our meal. Energy drink right before bed. Energy, Energy drink? It's this hydration drink. Blue Raz Prime Taste Test. Whoa. Logan cool. Paul and KSI. Great work. KSI as well. Repping the Brits. Let me taste. Whoa. That is really good. What are you eating? Just bread? Yeah. This meat was in the back of the U-Haul for like five hours. The one thing you're worried about on this trip is because of the meat was in the U-Haul too long. Given the other concerns, <laughs> that should not be at the top of your list. <laughs> what are you concerned about? Hypothermia, mountain lions, the treehouse collapsing, <laughs> cops. Mountain cops are the worst. <laughs> you guys can't tell how much this treehouse is shaking. But every time I move, it rocks pretty good. Samuel, before we left, was just casually mentioning, as it doesn't look like he weighs like a more than we do, but there's a little bit more of a weight difference. So he didn't calculate the floor to accommodate for said weight. I told him. In the meeting, I was like, I weigh however much I weigh. <laughs> he said the floor isn't even supposed to be like supported for just like me and Justin. What? Would you rather be in this house that collapses or Andrew's poops all over the walls? What? <laughs> That's way more extreme. The heck? Is it just cheese? <laughs> straight cheese? What? You're a weirdo eating straight cheese? Oh, this is Last just night. bread sandwich boy. <laughs> yeah. Here's the deal. We left the extra camera gear in the U-Haul, and this camera is about to die. Why didn't Samuel tell us to pack extra warm things? Kind of common sense. Like, hey, do you want to spend the night on the top of a mountain? Yeah, I'll just pack shorts. <laughs> I left my sweatshirt in the car. Yeah, you can get it if that would be awesome. Fit check. Oh yeah. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Ooh, too much fire. No, too much shaking. Hey, too much out. shaking the tree. I'm barely house. moving. Ah. I bought something exciting at the store, and I'm proud to present to you guys guitar lessons. This thing plays any song you want. Man, this is pretty sick. <laughs> <laughs> you were talking during my. Oh, sorry. Alright, let's try Bluetooth mode. It was working when I tested it at the store! <laughs> what the heck? You just pinch all of them at the same time? <laughs> and guys, get excited because this is actually our most boring activity. Oh, it gets oh from no, here. no. You're kidding. Yeah. I don't know if we can even turn this dang thing on. Oh my gosh, Samuel. Oh, wait, it's not plugged in. <laughs> Oh, oh, yes! This is the TV we used in that gaming room where we threw darts and hit the TV with the darts. Ugh. I only downloaded whatever number one on Netflix. A Halloween movie. What? I don't, don't want to watch. I don't want to watch a Halloween movie out in the middle comedy. of nowhere. Yes! Oh. Shark! Shark week! Sharks are my biggest fear. So it's kind of nice that I'm up here and they can't get me. Hit the lights, Andrew. Oh. Flubber! Ah! The Flubber <laughs> Mamba by Danny Elfman. Mm -hmm. Oh! What the heck happened? Please go poop. Not in here though. I gotta poop so bad. <laughs> that was so unrealistic. I just thought this was the absent minded professor. Is it not? The name of the movie? Yes. This is Flubber. With Robin Williams. But the absent minded professor is the same thing. Look on his phone, it says Flubber. Flubber. Guys, if you know what I'm talking about, comment because. The absent minded professor. Flubber is a remake of the absent minded professor. The moment I have been waiting for has arrived. Passer, robotic quarterback, oh, in here. Another kid toy. 
Oh, this ain't no kid's toy. No, we've played with this before. I'll try and catch it. I'm sure it's probably not that powerful. If you can catch this ball, I will give you $500. Are you being actually serious right yeah. now? Oh, are you being dead serious? <laughs> uh, yeah, if you can catch it. Oh, you're literally being serious. First try, yeah. Dude, if I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna dive. I'm gonna do whatever it takes. If this whole treehouse comes down, we dive. Can... There will be no diving in the treehouse. Where are you gonna dive? I'm, I'm aiming it at you. <laughs> are you ready? Does, does it have to be so close? Five hundred dollars. Oh, it moves. Whoa! Whoa! Oh! <laughs> Oh, no it. tackling! Oh, no oh, football in the house! <laughs> I mean, like, I don't, I don't even know where I think I, I have you. a nosebleed. Dude, literally, that's like a smidge to the right, I'd be blind in one eye. Double or nothing? <laughs> Double or nothing? Thousand dollars? <laughs> yes! <laughs> Double or nothing? I'm already getting nothing! <laughs> Body tuck? It has to Eric. shoot off first. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Triple or nothing. <laughs> oh! 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 Dude, I caught it. I caught it. Oh my god, bro. So I think I remember like 1500 or something. Dude, your farts are rancid. I'm sorry. I kept seeing comments that said I look like Hal Stewart from Megamind. And I was like, no, I don't. And then me and my wife watched Megamind like two nights ago. Oh man, I do kind of look like that guy. When you laugh, it shakes the whole house. Isaac has to go to the bathroom. I don't want- And he's had to go to the bathroom for the past three hours. Number two, he's been holding it and it is about to release. I'm not going out there. Did you poop in your sleeping bag? <laughs> We're gonna roll you out the door in the middle of the night and lock it. There's a bathroom right over there. We're gonna go with you. I don't want to poop. Oh, oh no! Oh, dude, I don't like this. Obviously, you guys can't tell, but it is insanely dark out. We're in the middle of nowhere where there's zero light pollution, so we can see the entire galaxy. Such a strange thing off in the distance. Hopefully, there's no mountain lions while we're walking around out here. Where even is the bathroom? This will be the highest poop I've ever taken. Yeah, look at this. They even wrote on the door here. Oh, oh thank oh. goodness. Oh. oh, let's go see what we got to work with. Nope, I'm going back. To Wait, the we got to see this. Oh, what? you're not supposed to look down in the toilet. You just sit on it and go poop. Dude, I can. Yes, you can. I can. That's For so scary. You in here. For the first I'm time in your life, you can't. go to the bathroom. Guys, leave Isaac some poop encouragement. <laughs> he needs the encouragement in the comments right I'm now. I'm just a little germaphobe. It's okay. Hashtag, it's okay to poop. <laughs> <laughs> What the heck are you doing? Dude, I what are you doing? You have no pants It's on. not a shower in there. <laughs> what are you doing? Dude, I got strip so I don't touch any of my clothes on this nasty floor. Put your pants back on. <laughs> the stars up here. Oh, what? There's literally no light for like hundreds of miles. I just saw one of the biggest shooting stars I think I've ever seen. I wonder if we keep looking if we'll just see more. I hope so. That was nuts. Oh, uh, no. Are you okay? Leave me alone. What happened? Nothing. Echo. What are you doing? Lots of giggling going on in there. Definitely the worst pooping experience of my life. You took off your pants, your hoodie, your jacket, and your beanie. Yes. <laughs> I didn't want anything touching the floor, dude. That floor. You did it, guys. Leave a like for Isaac. I did it, guys. I pooped. Thanks. <laughs> it is significantly warmer here in the treehouse. Oh, we got these hand warmers that we're gonna put on our feet. We just installed the electric heater. We had 20 hours of battery life on the generator, and when you plug in the heater, it brings it down to one hour. We're trying to be strategic on how we want to use the heat. I've never used these before, but that's kind of sick. You just shake it and it warms up. Yeah, man. Right in the sock. Oh yeah. <laughs> You could just stick your feet in the panini maker. <laughs> that, that'll warm them up. I'm a little questionable about the sleeping bag, but I've been in here for about five minutes already, and it's already warming up, feeling good. Dude, the shelf's not even hooked on. It's all right. What's the worst that could happen? Well, I guess nothing for you. <laughs> Me and Andrew are sleeping under it. I'm around the corner. Yeah, you going to bed? I don't know, man. This is so comfortable, and I'm freezing. You say on power, Isaac can hold a phone so we can watch a movie. Ooh. <laughs> Dude, the altitude, I can't do anything without just... 
Wait, Scott. <laughs> <laughs> the whole house is moving. <laughs> that would be the worst. Oh, dude. Hey, we get to 10 p.m. around. Can you zip me up? And this whole thing collapses. Andrew, can you zip me up? Yeah. Why did you have to unzip the entire thing? <laughs> Not today. Well, guys, it's midnight, so we're going to shut off the lights and hopefully get a good night's sleep. Hopefully, no mountain lions attack the house or uh, it just collapses. <laughs> <laughs> just an army of mountain lions attack. Yeah, you never know. We saw two meteorites. So what if one crash lands and knocks over the treehouse? <laughs> Please, I don't want to give you Heimlich. <laughs> I'm okay. All right. Oh. Whoa! Jerickson! Oh. It's like Christmas! It is almost Christmas, guys. Guys, if you like Christmas, go get some Jaystu merch at jaystuShop.com. Also, we are uploading on the music channel every Friday. If you didn't know we're making music again, better go check it out. This isn't the end of the video, guys. Don't make it oh, sound yeah. like it. Anyways, we'll see you in the morning. <laughs> what the heck is going on over here? Dude, this is the worst. Guys, what are you doing? I'm like freezing. Oh! oh. oh. Did you hear that? Dude. What the heck was that? That was the corner over here. It cracked? Dude, that was some that was some splintering wood for sure. We've been laying in here for 30 minutes. You don't have to roll around so much. We're just going to bed. Isaac's Stop moving. been having a wrestling match with himself in his sleeping bag for 30 minutes. He's taken off his hoodie. I took off my pants. I, can't. I don't know. You're cold. No, I'm not. I'm hot. You just said you're Dude, so cold. Feel my chest. I'm like overheating, but my, but my head's cold. Oh, put your beanie <laughs> on. Dude, that was a serious crack. What was that? That was the floor. No, no, that was probably the pole. Yeah. What? The stable? The yeah. thing holding this up? What else would it be? Oh. Uh-uh. What the heck's happening? Dude. I just opened the door, guys. <gasps> Where's the lights? We're on the ground now. <laughs> Turn the lights on. <laughs> like, is it raining? Like, what is we that? can literally get out now. <laughs> oh my god, dude! I thought it was raining, but that was just like splintering wood. Oh my god. Oh, that was the scary thing. How am I shaking? Oh, dude, dude, that dude. sounded so scary. It did. Literally. Well, at least our house is still together. Dude, like, it's one piece still. Hey, water didn't even spill. <laughs> yeah, what? Like, it literally, like, fell perfectly, like, just. Like, well, where'd all the poles go? You gotta go check it out. This is why this house fell over. He's taking off his pants, hoodie, wiggling around in the blanket. <laughs> dude, it's so. <laughs> dude, our shelf. <laughs> our shelf came down. Dude. You're all so our snacks <laughs> fell over. Dude, I was so hot, I had to take all my clothes off. It's not even hot Dude, here. it's cold. Dude, you're gonna freeze out there. Dude, the ladder. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> oh. The whole thing is still intact. Oh man. Look at it, it crushed our tree. <laughs> all the poles just folded on themselves. Oh, so it fell towards me. It all just, well, good thing it didn't fall into the water. We were literally right here, this close. Damn y'all. Guys, we were planning in the morning on getting epic drone shots. Oh, we still will. It'll just look like this instead. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, dude, the whole floor came out. That's why. That's the flooring. Oh. <laughs> That's the floorboards. I mean, we could still sleep in there, right? But where else are we gonna sleep? <laughs> We're in the middle of the mountains. <laughs> it's the middle of the night. Our treehouse fell down. He's in his underpants. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't plan on this happening, guys. There's a No, it's not. No, it's not. How? No, it's not. <laughs> what? Well, for the second time, we are going to bed. <laughs> I don't think anything else should be happening tonight. <laughs> yeah, but now we're closer to the ground for the mountain lions. Oh, no. <laughs> Great. We'll keep the camera near us if anything happens. Oh, man. Guys, it is officially morning. Cold as all get out in here. Dude, that was the worst night's sleep of my life whole life i think i'd have to agree but look at the view guys whoa oh guys i just saw something the lake is frozen over yesterday the lake was fine that just goes to show you how cold it got last night hey, muffins. Oh. Whoa. 
looks so good. The sun's finally peeking out and it's warming up. We're about to sit lakeside and drink some coffee. Oh. <laughs> Nothing like coffee in the morning. The lake is still frozen. Well, we accomplished the overnight, the world's highest treehouse. Remember guys to laugh daily and we'll see you in the next video. Cheers. There's these videos you can watch right now.